Hello everyone, I'm Lily from Digivisor and today I'm going to be taking you through a step-by-step -step tutorial on how we navigate Digivisor's organic owned performance tab and this will give you some great understanding on how you can become a really well flourished and data insights driven content marketer so you can make some amazing decisions in the type of content that you need to build into your calendars that will resonate with your audiences. So first of all, what you're going to see is you're going to be on the overview of your brand space. And here we can select on the period on period that we want to analyze. So simply select which period you want to see and drag and drop and enter. Then you'll see in the first module, a bunch of the social accounts that you've connected. Now these can be your Facebook business account, your Instagram business account, LinkedIn, it might be Twitter, or it might be YouTube. And you'll get this beautiful visualization of a quick pulse check on the performance within this period on your follower growth, your engagements, and your video views per individual platform, and that accumulated figure down the bottom. Now, this gives you a quick sense check of, wow, in this period, was my content thriving or was it potentially struggling or not as strong as the period beforehand? But what we want is really granular, nuanced kind of insights on each platform so that we can play to the specific algorithms and the content types and medias that those platforms prefer. So all we've got to do is just step into each of the individual accounts by clicking in to get a granular view of the performance on that specific platform. So let's just check out Facebook, for example. You'll be taken to this awesome screen that has a bunch of graphs located on your left vertical and then some beautiful visual snapshots of your content on the right. So quickly, we can sort by any metric that we want to kind of analyze our content against. So if you know you've posted a lot of video views this month, perhaps sorting by video views is the best metric to sort by. But if you know that you've been pushing out a lot of external blogs on Facebook, click-throughs is a great metric to see which ones are actually delivering traffic to your site. For the purpose of this, I just want to click on engagement to show you guys. So what you'll see is an actual analysis visually of all the content ranked by engagement in this period. Now, it doesn't take a rocket science to quickly realize that when we, for this example of Digivisor, use artificial illustrations, they're resonating less and being engaged less on Digivisor than using real world images of people and culture and snapshots. And even that is a quick content observation that's closer to the data point that we've been able to make so that we can build into the next round of content to introduce more people and real people in our content. You'll also be able to identify trends really easily within our graphs. So what you can see is an expansion, and you can minimize them as well, across all your important metrics and KPIs. So you'll be able to see impressions with their ranking period on period. So we've grown by 194% within the impressions in this period against the period beforehand across reach, video views, engagements, reaction, shares, comments, and click-throughs. Now, what's awesome about this is it is able to see very quickly when a trend has spiked. So we can see here on the 10th of September, there was a spike in impressions and reach within Digivisor's content. And so what I can then sort by is if I sort by impressions, I'm able to see what was that specific post to see if there's relevant type of content or is there a visual that's resonating? And then I can click on that post to be taken to the native platform and take that learning to my team. So I can then say, hey guys, this post resonated well with our audiences within this period. What's our learning? What can we take from this creative and build into our next round of content? One other particular awesome resonating experience is the ability to see these timestamps. So you can observe trends um, in when to post and when not to post. Export everything in CSV for seamless reporting as well.